This is going to be a real quick and dirty tutorial on how to change your rapid speeds and path pilot from the stock 110 and 90 inches per minute up to 200 on the XY and 120 on the Z. Linux CNC has some good documentation on what the parameters are and what they mean. And Tormach has published a good white paper on what steppers they chose and the reserve capacity they have. Uh, this table is rated on my 1100 series 3 for a thousand pounds. I'm only running a 30 pound vise plus occasionally a fourth axis. So I think 200 inches per minute is fine. First thing you're going to do is come up here to your MIDI line, uh, put in admin display. This is just so you can get to the background. I'm running this uh, touch screen. I'll just change it to that so we can get around it. Apply. Keep configuration. Now, mine, the most recent version of PathPilot does not have the toolbar on any other window that I can access using my monitor. I found the easiest way is just right quick. Create a new folder. Now open that folder. And there we are, we're in the file explorer. Now you just click on desktop. Let's delete this folder we just made. It's unnecessary. To get to the configuration files, you're going to go to operator. TMC, configs, Tormod mill, and then I'm running, you'll have to use your specific machine, but I'm running the Series 3, 1100 Series 3. So we want to open that. We're looking for, when you open it, this is where you're going to start. Don't mess with anything. Any of this, just scroll down to find axis zero. There we go. It's going to be your X. Let's change the inches a minute to 200. The max velocity to 3.3. Change the max acceleration, slow it down to 10. Only 20% higher. Change mine to 3.3, and then on your jog shuttle speed, also change it to 3.3. That's it. Don't mess with any other parameters. Come on down to axis. Here we go. Axis one, right here. Let's also change it to 200 inches per minute. Max velocity to 3.3. Slow the acceleration to 10. Steppers put it on 3.3. And then come down to your max jog. Change it to 3.3. Now for the Z axis. That's going to be axis two. This is your Z. I'm not going any faster than 120. You can. I haven't tried it. Change the max acceleration, I mean max velocity to 2. Also put the acceleration on 10. 20% higher change to 3. And on the max jog velocity, changed it to 2. That's all I've done. Go up here and hit save. Now you can close it. Before doing any editing, I would suggest right-clicking, copy to, and then put it on your desktop and save it as a backup just in case you mess something up and get back to it, back to stop. All you gotta do is close this, go back to your MIDI line, add them in display. Change it back to whatever is needed for your particular monitor. Now reboot for the changes to take effect. And 
yes, keep this configuration. Now let it reboot, see what we're doing. Uh, path pilots back booted up. Let's reference our axes. It's still only going 45 inches a minute. We didn't mess with that. That'll get done, however. Good jog speed. And right to 200. It's X and Y, Z. You can hear the limit switches still stop. Limit switches still stopping in plenty of time. All there was to it. I'm embarrassed to show my machine right now because I'm in the middle of a project and it's filthy. But...